This is Matensia maritima, a rare Scottish native that can be found growing on sand dunes and shingle beaches on the west coast of Scotland and some of the islands. Now I've never been lucky enough to see this plant growing in the wild, however it's thriving here in the garden at Tinnisburn Plants and I absolutely love it because of these intense blue bells that it produces from June onwards right through the summer. It's very characteristic of all the Matensias, this beautiful blue colouring but also the glaucous blue-green foliage as well. And in the case of this particular plant, that's what gives it its common name, the oyster plant. Now, I've never eaten an oyster in my life. However, I have tried the leaves of this plant and if they're anything to go by, I won't be eating oysters anytime soon. It was really, really salty and just tasted like the sea, which is quite remarkable for a plant that has seed raised here at the nursery and has only ever spent its life in this trough. It's never been anywhere near the seaside. You can imagine these growing on a beach somewhere, just the mass of blue-green foliage spreading out these long sprawly stems then dripping with these little intense blue flowers. It really must be quite a sight to see. However, these will grow equally well on a rockery as long as it's really well drained, but also like I've got it growing here in a trough and the good thing about this is that as the plant gets bigger during the growing season these sprawly stems then just start to tumble over the edge of the trough as well and look fantastic. It's worth growing just for these beautiful flowers however if you do like oysters you could pinch off the odd leaf as you go past and enjoy a little oyster treat.